Oh, you little... No, no, be careful, you little... Munchkins. Excuse me. Carl, what are you doing here? I just thought I'd come by and give you an early Christmas present. Stop it! We can't be seen together. <laughs> What's the big deal? Susan knows. The cat's out of the bag. Orson doesn't know. You didn't tell him. About the affair, yes, but he has no idea it's you. Now, Carl, please go. I promised him there'd be no scenes today. Carl? Oh, Lord. <clears throat> hey, Orson. I just came by to check on the decorations. Great job, Mrs. Hodge. Save it, Carl. I'm not an idiot. Orson, please. You obviously heard Bree and I are divorcing, and vulture that you are, you've swooped in to make a buck by representing Bree. Hey, man's got to eat. Perhaps. But soliciting business at a Christmas party? That's tacky. Even for you, Carl. If this is who you want representing you, that's your choice. But frankly, I thought you had higher standards. Remind me not to let him make a toast at our wedding. It's not funny, Carl. Just go before he figures it out. Yeah, about that. Uh, you know that Christmas present I mentioned? Don't you dare give me a present in front of all these people. I'm not sure I can stop it. It's being delivered by air. Carl, what did you do? Just let me make one quick call. 